Welcome to another enlightening video from Office Gladiator where knowledge is power. Today, we'll be diving deep into the realm of tenant rights, a topic that touches millions of us every day. We'll shine a light on the lesser known aspects of this critical subject including the complexities of eviction and the legal protections that you, as a tenant, are entitled to. We'll also be exploring the broader landscape of tenant rights, providing you with a comprehensive overview of the rights you may not even know you have. But, before we venture forth, we need your help. If you find our content valuable, please like, share, and subscribe to the Office Gladiator page. It's your support that enables us to continue bringing you these important and insightful videos. And don't forget, we also post videos on workplace advice, tips, and information, so there's always something new to learn. Stay tuned for a comprehensive breakdown of tenant rights. Remember, knowledge is power. Firstly, it's crucial to understand what tenant rights are. Tenant rights are the set of legal protections granted to individuals who rent or lease property. These rights are designed to ensure that tenants are treated fairly and that their homes are safe, habitable, and free from unreasonable disturbances. Now, it's important to note that tenant rights can vary greatly based on local and state laws. In other words, the rights you have as a tenant in one place may be different from the rights you have in another. That's why it's so important to familiarize yourself with the specific laws that apply to you. So, why are tenant rights so important? Well, consider this. When you rent or lease property, you're essentially entering into a contract with the property owner. This contract stipulates what you, as the tenant, can and cannot do within the property and what the landlord is responsible for. Tenant rights serve as a safeguard, ensuring that this contract is fair and balanced. They protect you from potential exploitation or mistreatment by your landlord. For example, tenant rights might prevent your landlord from raising your rent unexpectedly or from entering your home without giving you adequate notice. Tenant rights also guarantee certain basic standards for your living conditions. For instance, your landlord is typically required to ensure that your home is habitable, meaning that it has functioning plumbing, heating and electricity, and is free from pests and other health hazards. In essence, tenant rights are your shield, your line of defense against any potential breaches of your rental agreement or violations of your privacy and peace. They are a vital tool in maintaining a secure, peaceful living environment. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you know about your rights as a tenant, the better equipped you'll be to handle any issues that might arise during your tenancy. So take the time to educate yourself, look up your local and state tenant laws, read them carefully, and don't be afraid to ask questions if something isn't clear. Knowing your rights as a tenant is the first step to secure and peaceful living. One of the most stressful situations for a tenant is facing eviction. It's a situation that can make you feel powerless, but it's important to remember that as a tenant, you have rights. In most places, a landlord cannot simply kick you out of your home without a valid reason. They must have cause to evict you, and there are only a few legally acceptable causes. These may include non-payment of rent, violation of your lease agreement, such as having pets when the lease prohibits them, or illegal activity on the property. Even with a valid cause, a landlord must follow a specific legal procedure to evict a tenant. This typically begins with a written notice to the tenant, stating the reason for eviction and giving the tenant a chance to correct the issue. If the issue isn't resolved, the landlord can then file an eviction lawsuit in court. During this process, it's critical to understand that tenants have rights. For instance, the landlord cannot change locks, turn off utilities, or remove possessions from the property to force you out. These are known as self-help evictions and they're generally illegal. Furthermore, a landlord cannot retaliate against a tenant for asserting their rights like calling a health inspector about unsafe conditions. If you suspect you're being unfairly targeted for eviction, it's important to seek legal advice. After an eviction lawsuit is filed, you'll have the opportunity to present your case in court. This is your chance to dispute the landlord's claims or to point out if they didn't follow the proper eviction procedure. If the court rules in the landlord's favor, only then can a sheriff or constable legally remove you from the property. But even in this scenario, there are rules about how and when this can happen to ensure your dignity and rights are respected. In the end, the key is to know your rights and stand up for them. Even when facing eviction, remember you have rights. But eviction is just one aspect of tenant rights. Let's turn our attention to some other essential rights you have as a tenant. One of the most basic yet crucial is the right to a habitable home. This means that your landlord is obligated to maintain the property in a condition that is fit for habitation. 
Think of it as a guarantee that your home will have working plumbing, heating, and electrical systems, proper sanitation, safe and secure doors and windows, and no hazardous conditions such as lead paint or asbestos. If your landlord fails to meet these standards, you are entitled to seek legal remedies. Now let's talk about your right to privacy. This right protects you from unnecessary or excessive intrusions by your landlord. Yes, your landlord owns the property, but that doesn't mean they can barge in whenever they feel like it. They must provide reasonable notice before entering your home, typically 24 hours except in emergencies, and they can enter only for legitimate reasons such as making repairs or showing the property to potential renters or buyers. If your landlord violates this right you may have grounds for legal action. Another vital right you have as a tenant is the right to be free from discrimination. The Fair Housing Act prohibits landlords from discriminating against tenants based on race, color, national origin, religion, sex, familial status, or disability. That means they can't refuse to rent to you, charge you more, or treat you differently because of these factors. If you believe you've been discriminated against, you can file a complaint with the Department of Housing and Urban Development. These rights are your shield and sword in the renting world. They protect you from unfair treatment and provide you with the tools to fight back when necessary. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you know about your rights, the better equipped you are to protect them. These rights ensure you enjoy your rented home in peace and safety. As we wrap up, remember that knowledge is your greatest ally. We've spent time today demystifying tenant rights from understanding your fundamental rights as a tenant to the complexities of eviction procedures. We've explored other essential tenant rights, ensuring you are well equipped to navigate any situation in your rented home. But don't stop here. Continue expanding your understanding. There's a whole series of informative videos waiting for you on the Office Gladiator page. Each one is designed to empower you with the knowledge you need, not just as a tenant, but also as an employee and as an individual. So if you found this video beneficial, show your support. Like it, share it, and subscribe to Office Gladiator. Let's create a community of informed individuals ready to navigate the legal waters with confidence. Thank you for watching Office Gladiator, where knowledge is power. Stay informed, stay empowered.